Years ago, I visited the world famous Angkor Wat in Cambodia. Other than the jaw dropping splendor of the ancient civilization, another lasting impression imprinted in my mind was several giant trees growing on some of the old structures to the verge of almost causing them to collapse. Recently, those images came back to my mind when I had a chance to meet Dr. Victor Luna in an outing. We were on a recce for the Sarawak Cultural Village and we were looking at this giant tree at the Red Trail of Permain Rainforest Resort. The numerous roots reminds me of the lakes of centipedes. This is a very classic example of the fig tree. This is called strangler fig. Uh, it starts growing from the top, where the seed is being dispersed by birds, by animal, by squirrel, and the drop at between the branches. Eh? And then with the uh, factor of environment, got water, they start to grow down. The root grow down, and when we reach the the floor, it enrich, take some more nutrient from the earth, and uh, the root getting bigger and bigger, eventually will strangle the, the host tree. Now in this case, you don't see the host tree anymore. Uh, the host tree is gone already, it's died, being strangled leaving behind the fig tree itself become the dominant species yeah? so this is how with the dangling uh, root system uh, going down and the tree become what we call a dominant species where when we see it our perception it is it is it will touch our heart it become very very scary and some people believe it uh, these areas, there is a host of uh, a bad spirit living inside here and a lot of the uh, community, uh, even in Sarawak itself, a lot of various ethnic groups believe this. This is where the, the, the Marvelan uh, uh, ghosts live in these areas. Mm -hmm. This is the very iconic uh, plant itself. It helps uh, to produce fruits where birds are attracted to it and some of the uh, arboreal animals, squirrel, monkeys are uh, also uh, eating up the fruit. So this become a restaurant, the restaurant for the wildlife itself. Yeah? They do a good thing, but they do a bad thing for the horse plant. So if you see this dangling root, uh, there are a lot of uh, people believe that uh, this has become a net, you know. So if we People always don't want to sleep behind or near to this particular tree, yeah? especially in the during the hot sun, hujan panas. So that's where the the spirit will moving around in the forest, and you will get sick if you are uh, sleeping to this near tree. And even the Badayu believe that uh, how do we know there's a spirit inside here? What they do, they use a uh, an axe. They chop the tree and let it overnight. If the axe doesn't fall, it means the, there is no spirit there. If the axe, axe falls, meaning there is uh, somebody there. A closer look at the dangling roots. I must admit, it certainly gave me an eerie feeling. And uh, not only Asia Pacific, they do believe in this tree in terms of spiritual, uh, in terms of cultural values also, and religious values in this tree. But most importantly, uh, from the conservation point of view, it is very, very important for the wildlife itself. This is how the, uh, the forest uh, what we could develop, eh? because the seed is being dispersed by birds and start to grow elsewhere. Eh? This is the, the fruit. The seed is right there. Yeah. 
Where's the wap? Uh, the wap is living inside there. Hornbills are one of the birds that will eat these fruits and we could hear the sounds of hornbills while looking at the strangler feet. Those are the pollination agents, eh? mm. the wasps inside here. Okay. This fig tree in Bumbrata has taken over its host and growing on its own. Another fig tree that has strangled its host, this time in Eba Paradise. For many years, nobody dared to chop this fig tree a long reservoir road just outside St. Thomas's school fence until a fire finally burned it down. Love it or fear it, the strangler fit emits conflicting emotions. Many cultures fear it believing that it harbors spirits and there are cultures where fig trees play a positive role. Interestingly, it is a popular choice for bonsai lovers. So there you have it, the story of a unique tree that wraps itself around other trees, takes after their form and finally became the tree itself. Thank you for watching this video.